with a minute of squats. Let's go. Controlled. Three. Two. One. Two openers. Three opening on each side. Bring in the up and round. <coughs> and closing the gate.
Knees up. Knees up. Change legs. Three, two, one. Make sure your feet are hip width apart so you've got a wide base of support. Controlled. Let's get a little bit lower with that lunge. foot really 
Ten seconds. And time. Okay, I'm going to get to the top, but we'll just do a few different exercises. So, this first one, we're going to cycle through tapping. One, two, three, four, five. Ex flexing and extending the toe. And everting the ankle here, inverting the foot, so straightening the ankle. Okay, we're going to cycle through that. So let's go. Keep the foot on the ground, and just you're lifting the toes up. And then you're rolling to the outside of the foot. We're going to do skip ups instead of lunges. So it's a reverse lunge and driving up alternately. Okay, let's go.
The rest of it is just chill. <laughs> Doing really well. Over halfway. Feeling it? Yes. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. You feel the work of the lower leg. And time. Okay, change legs. Extend the weight through your right leg. Relax the toes. Air ball. Let's go. Posterior chain to pull to standing. It's not quite it, but I'm going to add this also. Nearly there. Time and change legs. Let's set ourselves up nicely, weight through the standing leg, right arm up, left, right leg up, and let's hinge. This is the last little jumping. We're just going to start off with some jumps, both feet together, little passes. Let's go.
back and forward. Come to centre, make a box. Not seeing a huge amount of movement, come on. Lifting and lowering. And time. Okay, what we're going to do is on the map, we're going to repeat those exercises so that we don't have to move around too much. On your block or your shelf, you're going to do calf raise, heel drop. Okay? And then in the next round, we'll do 20 seconds on each leg. So on the map, we're going to go again for skaters and calf raise. But don't worry, all of the relaxation will be on the next round. So, are we ready? Let's go. <laughs> what are you doing? Well, let's go. <laughs> Let those heels drop down. Enjoy the stretch as the heels come down. Ten seconds. Time. Okay, so this time we're going to do single leg for 20 seconds on each leg. And for the rest of us, we're doing log jumps, okay? Big log jumps. So I want to see those knees off the ground. Let's go.
Let's go. Into jumps. So you do single leg. Thirty seconds on each time. Little hops. Let's go. Left and right. Forward and back. Next right. 
on standing up this last yeah. week.
slightly better knee position. Let's go. Extending the leg. Step, step, that's it. Lovely. And time. Well, okay, we're going to come into a side plank with a bent knee and we're going to extend the top leg. So you're going to want the band around your knees. Maybe we'll do this one first next time so we'll have the band on our toes. <laughs> Are you all right with your leg top to be on? Okay. Yes. Alright. Okay. So side line. Hips stuck, lifting that top leg. Just let me need to come up the mat. I don't know if down there. That could be down or up. Yeah, 
that's the feet. Let's get ready. There you go. sure the feet are parallel so you don't want the lifting leg to be open out to the side. Projecting the same amount forward, your hip should be one on top of the other. The glutes should be working. Ten seconds. 
So check your knees are coming together and they're not staggered when they come together. Check when they come together, they're one on top of the other. Let's change sides and do it again. Let's go. It's a bit of a 
an oblique movement in there. Um, so we're going to stay on our elbows and we're going to lift one elbow up and then the other side. So really working on our stabilizing, stabilizing muscles so good for running. Right, come on you. Let's go. Seconds and tabletop, let's go. And bicycle crunch straight into it. Twist in the body, knee to elbow. Thank you. 
down. Really right into the bridge. Three, two, one, and hold. And do a very quick release before we come on to our front. So, this time we are going to do a single leg uh, bent knee hip extension. I'll just demo. So, move down here and one leg is up, the knee comes down like so. Okay, let's go. down, the other foot is away. The knee that touches down is not your lifted one. Ten seconds. And time. Well done. Okay. We're going to go into a downward dog. <laughs> and up we go. So it's on the, up into a lovely dog. Hips high. The front of your thighs pushing to the back of your thighs. Let the heels go down, and you want to think about your ankles being as open as possible. You do not want to fall or crease in your ankles. So lift, lift, lift at the ankles. Can you get your heels to the ground? Can you lower them towards the ground? Keep lifted at the ankles. Going to do that again. Going in three, two, one. Up into a long door. Hips super high. Front of the leg pushing to the back of your legs. Open up the ankles and pedal. Jennifer's got no room to pedal because she's so flexible because her heels are ground. And come back to dog stationary. And move through to plank. Pike up to dog. So plank. And to dog. And knees down. And turn around so you're on your bottom in that lovely unisit position. Hands facing forwards, knees tucking in, pushing away, pushing away, tucking in and pushing away. Lovely day. 
Dana with your belt. <laughs> I hope someone's brought a picnic. <laughs> Halfway, come on. Punching in, extending away. You can do it. Just 10 seconds, come on. Come on. Five, three, two, one. And just tuck in. Well done. Great work, everybody. That is your lot. Thank you.